that. Look at him. <laughs> Can you talk to her? <laughs> yeah, I, I called almost every day, too. Good. <laughs> I mean, that's about it. Yeah. Yeah. Tell him hi. Ready to go? Yeah, see you in the so. operation we table. The so uh, we have to be there at six. You guys be there at six. We'll probably get them in the room just after like seven fifteen or okay. so, and then seven twenty, and then we'll that get out. started. Okay. We'll, I'll let you know as things go along. Once we get okay. the first implant in, I'll call you. And we'll have the nurse call you, and then we'll keep going with the other side. Oh, so you are a good boy. With that nice clear eardrum. Great. Can I look at the other one? You're such a good patient. You are such a good patient. But I'm so used to being poked up. You've got nice looking ears. How about that? Thank you. Are thank ready you. To go. Too bad they don't work. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we'll get them going here. Right. He's going to have the, the now the the implants are going to go under the muscle. On, under the skull. So behind though, because we've seen some that are way up. Yeah, they're gonna be they're gonna be behind. The okay. the, the um the okay. magnet is gonna go right about here. That's okay. perfect. The implant okay. will come right here and then the magnet will go here and then he'll wear the processor okay. like this. And how do you get them even? Well we, <laughs> I always put implants exactly the same position, but you know, we'll try and get them as even okay. as we can, yeah. Now we're not gonna in kids this size, because the the N five implant is so so thin. Mm hmm we really don't need to drill on the skull at all. We just okay. put them, on, we slip them under the muscle, uh -huh. and they just sit there. Okay. Uh, and the muscle holds them down. We do have to go in through the mastoid to get the electrode in. Yeah, it forms a capsule uh, around it and holds it in place. Okay. But they're so thin that they just slide under there, and they don't, we haven't been really doing a lot of drilling in, in children. Wonderful. Let's Even go. Even in adults, sometimes we're not. We're just doing just very minimal. And uh, three and a half hours. That's what you're thinking? Yeah. If everything goes three okay? Half, it'll be about three and a half. Yeah, I mean, that's about and right. What I usually do, sometimes people, when they do this, they prep the whole, They we prep, wash both sides and sort of get everything ready for both sides. Uh -huh. What I do is I do one side at a time. Okay. I get one side washed, we do one side, we close Completely one side, closed, and then we take right. the drapes down, re re -brace the other side, we you know, re wash the other side, re drape it. I don't do it, I separate it, because okay. I think it's, that's what I prefer to do. So I just do it one time. Over. That adds about 15, 20 minutes to the surgery just okay. in changing sides. Okay. So, so I feel it and see yeah. it. And then, and then okay. what do we expect afterwards, like in terms of the healing and how soon and bandages coming off and the all of that stuff? The bandage stays on for about the first day. It's not very tight. Okay. If it's too tight, it puts too much sure. pressure on the skin over the implant sure. and that can cause the skin to break down. It's not it's just basically just kind of fluffy. Okay. It's not really tight. I don't know, buddy. It doesn't really need to be tight because okay. the implant is so snug in there. There's no real need for like a pr it's not really a pressure dress, it's just kind of to catch anything. And there's really not gonna be a lot of injury. We'll just have skin tape on the skin. Okay. Behind the ear. And those come off at one week. Uh, and then after the first week, we, you know, so basically the first day after surgery, he's got the fluffy dressing, you take that off the next day. Everything comes off except for the tapes on the skin. It looks like a little packing tape. Okay. And, and there's a other, everything else comes off, all the white gauze. Sutures inside, sutures out, skin, outside? Skin. Just under the skin. And then the tapes just hold it, just okay. hang it together. But most of it, you actually don't even really need the tapes. We put them on. Yeah. The sutures are so nice that it's. You could almost just leave it or put glue, but we just put a tape on there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. And then we'll still get activated. And then how long yeah. after the um, you're done does it normally take before we get to take him home? Um, Is it's it probably in the afternoon sometimes, just after we so make sure he's eating, drinking, a few hours. and so forth. Okay. Yeah. Now eating eating isn't super important for the first okay. couple days after, but drinking is. You okay. really got to push the fluids and everything. Okay. And you know, for the first day, you might use just Pedialyte or something like that, rather okay. than like rather than milk no or milk or yeah. For the first day, you'd rather put some just clear clearish fluids, Pedialyte okay. or something like that. Okay. Right? Thank you so uh, much. Stay right here. Okay. I'll okay. See you guys tomorrow. All right. See you okay. then. Bye bye now. Thank you, buddy.